So, I have to come to my storage unit to do this. Uh, this is the only place at my scale. I know I gained a lot of weight during the pandemic because during the time I was waiting for my unemployment to clear, which took roughly about 103 days, I know I ate a lot of unhealthy food. So, we'll go ahead and see what this ends up showing. I predicted that. That's not good. I just did my weigh-in at my storage unit, and so the goal I wanna do is try to lose 80 to 90 pounds by the end of the year. Right now, from when I'm uh, filming this, it's 106 days from now. I believe it's totally plausible with uh, hard work. I'm still young enough where uh, if I put in the effort, I can do it, uh, completely cut carbs, do it six days a week. I'm not gonna do it seven because I have a weird work shift that changes over and it's it's complicated but i kind of need that one day off during that time and also i will i'm going to use it to do laundry and and personal stuff along the way so um definitely plausible if i do 80 that's good that's like the target goal if i hit 90 and 106 days that's like i did a superbly good job and overestimated what i was hoping for but the minimal is 80 and i hope to get that done by um the next 106 days, which will be the 2021 by then. So hopefully, you know how people start New Year's schools, mine will be to get this stuff down. All right, so I may have found the perfect park to uh, exercise at. I am here now and it has three levels. It pretty much has the bottom level, which is the main park. This is where there's a playground, a huge grass area to play any sports balls or anything like that. Um, it's completely open, uh, you know, flat surface. There's uh, tables and stuff you can barbecue and just a really good time. And then there's a secondary level that has a trail that goes all the way around the whole park it's just a small trail and, and it has inclines that are a little bit, you know, up and down. They're a little bit steep, but they're not like far. It's like a couple yards up and then it comes back down again. And then there's a third level that could take you a while that has really steep inclines that uh, I'll post that take, you know, the, that also go around the park, but it can take, you know, a lot longer, maybe two hours or something for that kind of hike. Uh, Obviously, if you're not running and you're kind of slow walking. Now, to exercise, I don't want to just start grabbing weights and workout gear and just running. I'm worried about my knees and stuff at my age. I don't think I have medical insurance anymore because of the pandemic. We'll have to see on that. Actually, I want to look that up soon. But um, the secondary level and the first level are perfect. The secondary level, uh, you know, because you got to have your heart rate up. So just walking around the park can help, but you kind of need some inclines. But the inclines aren't too long and steep that cause problems. So I think for a couple of weeks, I'm going to just say, do the secondary level and go on a hike. And then when I start getting exhausted, but not too tired to go home yet, then I'll just go to the first level and just kind of walk around the park once or twice. But it's, it's a really great place I think I could lose weight. Because for the first couple weeks, I'll just go on the secondary level and the first level. And then after that, and I start getting a little bit in better shape and losing weight, I'll start going on the third level, which is a much longer hike. And after doing that for a little while, I think I'll start like running and doing stuff like that, you know. So I have to be careful. Um, you know, the last thing you want to do, I, I've seen those videos where people are out of shape and they want to go full force and just start running and, and they end up messing up their knees or back or something like that. Because I'm so out of shape, I kind of want to ease into it, uh, you know, so, but at the same time, you also have to keep the heart rate up for it to work out. Gyms are closed right now. I wouldn't mind lifting weights. I don't have any weights. I don't have any money. Uh, as you could, you know, as I've seen in my previous videos, I've, uh, you know, I've been living out of my car, so. I don't have anywhere to really work out other than to do this. Just a classic push-up, sit-ups in the park and hiking. So that's my goal for this challenge on losing weight. I gotta be quick because you know I'm a guy by myself in a park 
that's actually really busy. That was a good positive thing. In case something happens, there's plenty of people around. All right, so I'm here with my last meal. Um, well, last like high carb meal. I decided to do the keto diet when it comes to uh, starting tomorrow. I'll, I'll start doing all that, but realizing now I have to lose close almost 100 pounds is pretty scary. I was I gained maybe probably about 40 pounds with the whole COVID thing. Uh, once again, my issue was um, just late on you know not getting any unemployment and just eating pretty much spaghetti and peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. So, this will be my last meal. It's a, a White Claw, one of the hard seltzers, and then here is a barbecue chicken pizza, and uh, then tomorrow I'll go all healthy, even though this pizza isn't too, too bad, but anyways, uh, thanks for sticking around, and uh, I think I'll do the updates once a month. Well, I'll weigh myself in once a month and see how things go. And I'm excited for my new trail because I actually enjoy it. I, I like that area. Um, it's really nice and peaceful. So I'm looking forward to it. And uh, the weight part is definitely going to be a pill, but I think I'll be able to get it done. Anyways, thanks for sticking around. Bye.